In this video, we'll write the balanced net ionic equation for HBr plus Na2CO3. This is hydrobromic acid plus sodium carbonate. The first thing we need to do, we need to balance the molecular equation. This is the molecular equation. When we look at it, we see we have two sodium atoms here and just one. Let's put a two in front of the NaBr. Sodiums are balanced, but now I have two bromide ions. So let's put a two in front of here. Those are balanced, two hydrogens and the oxygens. This is the balanced molecular equation. Now we can write the state for each substance. For HBr, if you're not told it could be aqueous or it could be a gas, really doesn't change much. Let's just say that it's aqueous. We'll put an AQ in there. It's a strong base, so this is aqueous. It'll dissolve and dissociate when we put it in water. For the Na2CO3, sodium compounds are very soluble. So this is going to be AQ. It'll dissociate into its ions. Another sodium compound here, carbon dioxide, that's a gas, and then water, that's a liquid. So we have the states for our net ionic equation. Now we can split the strong electrolytes into their ions. That's going to give us the complete ionic equation. So for the HBr, hydrogen group 1, that's going to be 1 plus. The bromide ion, that's 1 minus. So we'll have two hydrogen ions, H plus. I'll write the states later plus two bromide ions, that's the Br minus. Sodium's in group one, and it's one plus. The whole carbonate ion, good one to remember, is two minus. Two sodium ions, and then we'll have the carbonate ion, that CO3, two minus. So these are the reactants in our net ionic equation. For the products, we said sodium's positive, bromine have it negative. So two sodium ions, again, just like the reactants, plus two bromide ions. And then for net ionic equations, we don't split gases or liquids apart. So we'll just have CO2 plus H2O. So this is the complete ionic equation. Now we can cross out the spectator ions. They appear on both sides of the complete ionic equation. So as we look across here in the reactants, the top, and then here are the products down here, we have two bromide ions in the reactants we also have two bromide ions in the products. We can cross those out. Those are spectator ions. Two sodium ions here in the reactants. Again, in the products, two sodium ions. Cross them out. That's it. This is the net ionic equation for HBr plus Na2CO3. I'll clean this up and write the states. We'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for hydrobromic acid plus sodium carbonate. We can see the atoms, they're the same on both sides. And if we count the charge up, two times this one plus, that's two plus, two plus, two minus, that balances out net charge of zero here. These are neutral net charge of zero. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for HBr plus Na2CO3. Thanks for watching.